Okay, so good morning everyone. This is the video reference for your activity and empowerment technology module number 3. So first, syempre kailangan mong tignan at i-open ang Word 2013. This one. So i-open na natin siya. Okay, so pag na-open mo na ang Word 2013, lalabas ang parang ganito. So, ito yung magiging itsura niya. Ito yung lalabas sa screen nyo. So, doon kayo pupunta sa blank document. Blank document. Double click or click enter. And then, ito ang lalabas sa blank document. As you can see, meron tayong iba't ibang tab under Word document. So, eto, meron tayong file tab, meron tayong home, meron tayong insert, meron tayong design, page layout, reference, mailings, review, and view. So, himay-himay natin. Let's go first sa file. Under file, makikita nyo ang etong mga features. So, pag klinik natin ang file, makikita nyo ang mga features na open save save as print so ito yung mga importanting um, section dito sa ating file file tab you can able to save a certain document so just click save and then go to browse ayan so dito na lalabas na yung parang tab where you can Put down the file name. Let's say, for example, your file name is your name. Let's say, Annaline. That's your name. Ayan. So, ito yung file name natin, Annaline. Save as to, of course, Word document. And then, just click the word save here. Okay. Automatically, that is being saved. Now, you can also print a certain document here ayan okay so ito yon. click mo lang copies print and then connect mo ang cord ng printer ayan then that's under files section next is the home so under home home section meron tayong iba't ibang features we have the font size eto yun. Ba, may letters na kayo dyan. Let's say, for example, letter E. Meron na kayong word, um, eat. Okay, so, click mo lang kung mag-change ka ng font size. Let's say, for example, you want font size number 48. And, nandito naman, yung font style. So, meron tayong iba't ibang font style. Gusto mo Bernard MT Condensed. Ayan. So, it will depend on your desire kung anong font size at font style. Pwede mo rin gawing bold letters. Pwede mo rin gawing italicized letters. And of course, you can put under line. Ayan. So, yun lang. And of course, under this section, you can also um, select the bullet form kung meron kang i-enumerate. Ayan, and then click, click lang para lumabas yung mga bullet, bullet, bullet. Ayan, so click, click mo lang. Ayan, lalabas yung mga bullet. Okay. Okay, so that's under home section. Now let's put and proceed to insert. Under insert, maran tayong table. You can put a table here in your document. Let's say, for example, you want this kind of table. Ayan, lalabas siya. Pictures. Pwede ka mag-insert ng pictures. Pwede online and offline. Okay. So, yun lang. Just click it down. Let's say, for example, this one. You want this picture to be added in your document. Okay. So, you want this. Ayan. Automatically, lalabas na siya. Okay. So, under insert section also, you can have online pictures, 
shape, smart art, chart, and screenshots. That's under insert section. Now let's proceed to design. So under design, meron tayong iba't ibang features under design. So meron tayong theme. Okay, so kung anong gusto mong theme ng iyong document. And then we also have watermark, page color, and page borders. Next, page layout. So under page layout, you can put a margin orientation. So orientation is portrait or landscape. Then size and column. Okay, next, reference. So under reference, mayroon tayong iba't ibang table of contents. You can add table of contents sa reference natin. And also, you can update the table and then insert footnote. Next is mailing. For the mailing, you can start. So in our previous lesson, we had start mail, merge, select recipient, envelopes, and labels. Next section is review. For review, you can have the spelling. You can check your spelling and grammar. Thesaurus. Translate and language. New comment. Show comment. And you can also restrict the editing. You can lock it down para hindi may edit ng ibang tao ang document. And then the last section is last tab section is view. For view, we have read only, print layout, web layout, zoom, and everything else. Ayan. So, that's the features of Word Document 2013. Thank you so much.